Welcome to Mishnah Study. Over here in this Mishnah, I'm going to discuss a caravan that camped out in a valley, right? So people were traveling, they were on the road for the week, and Shabbat's about to roll in. So they said, okay, we're going to hang out in this valley, um, and we need to make an eruv. How do we make an eruv? So here, this is the first time we're actually building an eruv from scratch. So shehanat babika, you have this caravan that, you know, people, people, camels, everything, they were traveling with all their, with everything they had, and they decided to um, dwell, they used to sit, rest in the uh, valley. The kifua kedebehema, they took whatever they had. They had plows with them. They had, you know, all these different types of, you know, things that they would use for, for working the field. We know for their animals, saddles, whatever they may have had, they took it and they wrapped it around them, right, to create an eruv. Now you're allowed to carry within it. You could carry within this, uh, within this eruv that they just created from everything, all the uh, materials that they had. On condition that the fence itself, right, when, when you stand everything up, it has to be at least 10 tefachim high. Right, the minimum size of a mechitza is ten tefachim. Another condition: you can't have the open breaks, the open areas, more than the closed off, the built areas. Right. So if you're building out, let's say you had a, uh, you know, twenty feet of closed off areas of of a block. Right. You could only have nineteen feet. I'm saying that purposefully now, right? But we'll, we'll see. In a second, right? You can only have less than that, right? You can have more openings, right? I should say, right? you can have more openings than the um, the the uh, the closed area, right? So it's actually it could be equal, right? If you have twenty feet of a uh, closed off area, you could have twenty feet of open areas, right? You just can't have more open area than closed off area. Now, kol pirza shehi keiser amot. Let's say, though, you have an opening that's more than 10 amot wide, right? If you have an opening that's 10 amot wide, that's okay. That's the max. More than that, if it's more than 10 amot wide, that's it. It annuls the whole thing, right? That's already considered a, a, a gap a break in the Eruv, and you cannot use it unless, unless it's a Surat Petah, right? Unless, unless we mentioned that you have the, uh, you know, you turn it into a doorway, right? Which would be okay, even if it's more than 10 Amot, as we mentioned. And um, these are actually important principles to remember when building, uh, when building an Eruv, when it comes up, um, you know, that you can't have more open area than closed area. You can't have a gap of more than 10 amot. If you do, you need to create it and turn that into a surat petach, into a uh, doorway, and then you could go ahead and use that as an image.